Hi everyone. So I'm just popping on for a quick live. You may have seen the thumbnail for the live is actually the stamping up. And um, let's see if I can show you now. Can you see that? The stamping up storage. I managed to get that with my demonstrator perks for good performance during celebration for both recruiting of new stamping up demonstrators and also for sales so i'm really really happy about that now um i've kind of done my back in trying to sort it all out anyway i thought I'd come on and i'd show you my other small items it wasn't much there's four things but the fourth thing i'll leave to the end hi susie i'm just jumping on quickly honey um i'm really sad because i got quite excited that i purchased some branded shopping bags for my customers which is awesome um as i like to recycle i will ask them to um try and give me them back so that i can give them again for their next order and um yeah i needed some more white cardstock and i finally treated myself to the UK plug, if I can get it open, finally got the Stampin' Up heat tool. So excited. I like everything to match. Wow, awesome. I love it. First rule of thumb is always remove this. Such a hazard. Such a hazard if you were to plug in. So, very similar to my other one, actually, which is uh, not a Stampin' Up! branded one. But I'm very happy that it now matches all of my other tools. So, the one thing I did want to share, I just managed to jump into my shopping basket, you see, is the seriously the best project kit. Now, um, this has been around a little while. And that's me just actually buying it. So, some really nice colours in here. It comes in a really secure packaging, okay, to protect this wonderful little box, which has a little gold stud there with a little bit of Calypso Coral elastic. So let's open it up. Oh, look. How cute. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, I need to buy some more of them just for the box. That's a definite. Right, let's um, let's get this open. Let's see. And then I could pop all the supplies back in the box, like so. Now I can't actually see any more comments on here. I'm not sure if people are watching, but you can see it on catch up if you're not here live. It's just a quick ad hoc jumping on to share this basically okay what do we have so it says oh fancy hang on so we have some things hid hidden in here let me see now we have lovely um c6 envelopes which have Gorgeous. Now, hang on, I could see the comment. The comments keep disappearing. Hi, Kirsten. Well, that's a good idea. I could pop their names on it. Definitely. So we've got these envelopes that are have gold foil in the inside. So there's one. Let me see the old gold one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Are they all gold? I think they may be. Yep, they're all gold. That's good. So how many is there? Let me try and count. Two, four, six, eight. Who do we appreciate? 10, 12, 14. Wow, 16. That's quite good. 16 and we have beautiful cards. That's nice. I think that's terracotta tile. One, two, three, four of those. Let me move my scissors. We have 
for um, Bami Blue. So that's nice. We have four terracotta tile with the gold embossing on the front with the gold section. Nice. And then we have another four. This is mint macaron, I'm sure, with a lovely gold and white stripe. Nice. So, a whole array of colours there. 16 cards, 16 envelopes. Brilliant. Now, what do we have? We have some vellum, which is the coordinating colours, the same as the card. So, it's four of those. You can cut them up to get more than one card out of it. We have four um, die cut circles with stitched shape. There's two sheets of that, so there's four. There's two sheets of this one, which is like a rectangle that's off at an angle and some banners and whatnot. Oh, and we have some card card fronts that could be cut up as well. There's four of those. Oh, even more labels. Amazing. So we've got some that are like diamond well, flagship at the end. Hi Tracy. It's coming off to coming on to show a little um card kit that I got with this beautiful box which is available from the online shop that should be in the descriptions below. And then we've got two sheets of these beautiful birds. Love it. Now this is a part inclusive kit. You do get fully inclusive kits which give you a stamping block, a little stamping pot with ink or watercolour pencils. Um, they're in the higher price range but they're really ideal for beginners so if you haven't tried stamping up um, the project fully inclusive kits are a great way to start and we have four vellum banners so I'm looking forward to playing with those I may use these up very quickly um, and use these as customer thank you cards for the month of April Awesome, so that, oh, and we have this, which is twine, baker's ribbon, baker's twine, and this looks like uh, Chris Curry or Mango Melody, there's quite a lot on that, and we have beautiful little gold sequins, which are adhesive backed, and gold flower sequins, so that's amazing. I do like that. And the last thing we have, which are the most beautiful thing ever, is four sheets of these um, flourishes. So we have, the colours are, I think it's mint macaron. Mint macaron with um, pretty peacock. So those are amazing. And everything complements each other beautifully. So I shall pop them back in my lovely little box which is so sturdy I love it absolutely love it so that is all for my little call um, so you can see here all the um, ideas and whatnot. really good now this does go ideally with a stamp set which is called seriously the best and I do have that, which is fabulous. So um, this is Seriously Based Project Kit, obviously. So it goes with Seriously the Best there. Right. Oh, my comments have disappeared. Hang on. I used to be a demonstrator, but I had to stop a few years ago. Think. Oh, fab. It's just a shame you missed out in the great joining offer, Tracy. I mean, the joining offer is good all year, but January to March, there's always extra little perks and stuff. But um, head over to my website at smithscraftcreations.com and there's lots of information about joining my team on there, some questions about minimum spends and things like that. And just pop me an email or catch me on Facebook, one of my um, social media pages, no problem. 
if you want to have a wee chat. Um, yes, yeah, so you can also, if you're thinking about joining Stampin' Up, um, our new catalogue is due to launch on the 4th of June. And if you want to join Stampin' Up, um, if you join between the 5th of May and the 2nd of June, you can choose new catalogue items as part of your starter kit, which is amazing. So that's the 5th of May, and that's when I'm able to order some pre-order of the new goods as well. I haven't seen what anything's like, so it's going to be a big surprise. Um, okay, folks, uh, nice and short and sweet today. I can't get my phone out of this holder. There we go. Um, so, yeah, any questions, just leave me a little message. I'll get back to you or give me your email address. And um, I'd like to thank you for popping on. Take care, everyone. Bye.